hey guys, I spoke to you last week about why A-level physics is a great option. Now I'm going to talk to you about why A-level chemistry is a great option. Because it is. It really, really is a fantastic option for you to be picking. Um, I know I'm biased because I teach A-level chemistry um, and it's really good fun. Um, and that's a really big reason why it's a good option to pick. Because it's really good fun. Um, we get to do proper, proper experiments. Um, so no more are you going to be in a massive class that might have like 30, 35 people in it. Class sizes are going to be much smaller, um, partly because the experiments are dangerous and we don't have, can't afford large amounts of equipment to do large class sizes, partly because we well, used to get smaller classes um, at A level, but we get to do proper experiments, like dangerous experiments, experiments that turn pretty colours and explode and where I have to read out very long safety briefings at the beginning of the experiment just in case anybody might kill themselves or die accidentally. Um, it gets properly dangerous at A-Level Chemistry, which is fun. Okay, Obviously it's all safe and you know I've, I've been doing A-Level Chemistry for years and years and years and I've managed to not cause myself any serious injury in that time so um, hopefully I will not have any serious injuries in the years to come by A-Level Chemistry but yeah the practicals get really really good fun um, and there are more practicals than you've been doing at A-Level we have required practicals now so there is like a set number that you have to do um, and stuff gets really really interesting I mean like really interesting you know electrons how you think they're just boring things that we around the circle they're not they're so cool they do so so many interesting things I mean electrons are basically the basis for all life on earth I know and you thought well, they were just things that you had to draw in circles they're not they're amazing and you know, we kind of like gloss over things slightly at GCSE and go, electrons do this. And then at A level we tell you the truth of the what amazing things that go on. Um, you get to see there's so many different ways that A level chemistry is like basically fundamental to life. Not only kind of like actual living life, but your everyday life, like going around in society, doing so many different things, things like um, how gel nails work, um, how tights work, um, various different things like that. You know, the invention of Kevlar, which has saved millions and millions of lives, invented by a brilliant, brilliant woman, kind of accidentally. Um, she never thought that it would go on to to do what it did. She never invented it to, to save millions and millions of lives, but she did. And that's what that's what a chemist does. It's all about, you know, making people's lives better, saving lives. Um, there is quite a lot of maths in A-level chemistry. Um, you don't have to do A-level maths to do A-level chemistry. It's slightly different to A-level physics where A-level maths would really help you out. Um, because, you know, a good chemistry teacher can teach you the, the maths in A level chemistry um, without you having A level math as well but A level maths will make things a little bit easier um, and it goes really well with odd combination subjects so you can do like English, Arts and Chemistry as well it's a really really well respected A level by the universities so there you go guys I'm obviously um, completely biased because I love A level chemistry um, but it is a really, really good option for you to pick. Um, I know loads of my students pick it just because they're interested in it, not because they want to do anything with it at university, but because it is genuinely, genuinely a really, really interesting subject to take at A level. Um, so, yeah, I hope loads of you will be joining me on my A level chemistry channel next year because I've convinced you that A level chemistry is awesome.